Or solve me. We're connected. Go ahead. Get this spark going here. Got it. Strange. It looks important though. Look around. There may be more to this riddle. Of course there is. There we go. So the first thing about this level that's different from the other parts of Condemned is that it really takes place in a centralized location. Hi XP, thanks for coming on. Traditionally, or the rest of the levels in Condemned usually move you forward in a building. And even though you are in one location, oh geez, that's going to be creepy, you're still kind of making progress in said building. Here, we're in this one location and it's up to us to basically solve this puzzle to get around. Oh. Just adds a little bit more structure to this kind of gameplay compared to oh, really need... There we go. Hmm. I'll take the poker. You can hear footsteps above, too. Oh boy. The painful one is going to be going downstairs into the basement or the cellar. That's the one that those of you who've played the game know how tough that one can be. Also looking around for all the little goodies as well. I'm sure that will come back for us at some point. Should be starting to run into some of the locals. Oh boy. This is the tough one, or the annoying one. You'll see why. And these guys are going to be coming infinitely at us, too. This is the one part that can be a little bit annoying. So they will not stop until we leave the basement. I'm not a fan of infinitely spawning enemies like this either. Is this thing? They won't be very, very quiet. Out here. 
before I have to cry kick my way through all manner of crazy homeless people. There's probably goodies. Oh crap. There's probably hidden items around here, but again, I don't want to be down here all night long. There it is. Very evil dead, that reminds me of, too. Whew. The good news is that was the most annoying part of this section. Now, of course. I think there's one more sore spot in Condemned. I think that is the final quote unquote boss of the game. Again, the pacing is just really well done here. I think this is when we're about to get into a fight. Once we've gotten all four, that's when <laughs> keeps making noises there. That's when the fun starts. And this is great having a flashlight that doesn't die on you. Sledgehammer was downstairs, right? Oh, wait, is this one? Ah. Oh, thank you. Breaking in. Found one door, now I can't find the other. <laughs> oh, come on. Been there. I got a sledgehammer, it's all ready to go. Just like with every horror convention, we go from the cellar to the attic. Crap. 
creepy in. Uh-oh. Oh yes, yeah, this dude. Kung Fu serial killer fight. We do get his crazy sticks. Once we get this last one, that's when we will be able to move on in this damn area. Oh look. It's been a very long time since I played this one too. Yeah, that's going back down. Here's the crazy dude. <laughs> hmm. That's weird. Am I missing something here? So we have to go here. It's a creepy layout there. <coughs> Can't break through it. Hmm. This is the downside of not playing this game in years. underneath here. It shouldn't be... Hmm. If the door is locked, then it would be assumed that the trigger hasn't gone off yet to get me out of here. So either I missed it, or something's wrong. What's underneath here? Wait a minute. It did. <laughs> it did break. Now it's back. Good. So now we jump down here. And we should find our fourth clue. There we go. Now we get to the action.
to be entering. And I don't remember what the solution is either, off the top of my head. Need something to do with a mirror? Should have to be going back down to the basement. And after this level, we still have a battle in the barn. Oh, good. a crowbar or anyone. I think that just holds weapons, so I don't think it's required. Oh, you got all your damn clues, buddy. Oh, yes. I just remembered. The next area is going to be pretty crazy. Figure it had to do with a mirror. But where is there a mirror? I I do like the fact that we're just basically getting the terrain down for this house. be a mirror in the bathroom, but... glass everywhere. <laughs> this is where the stamina bar is really not helping matters. Painful now. My kingdom for a mirror. You don't think it's down there, do you? it otherwise. I hate to go back down into the nasty place. I may not have a choice. Random 
some sound effects too. Well, it's, I'll do one more check upstairs. If it's not there, then we'll head on down. Wait, did I come over here yet? I think I did. Yep, here's the second bathroom. <laughs> I know it's on the attic. Looking like I'm not having much of a choice here. down to the basement. Hmm. I am remembering that I think I had this trouble when I first, when the last time I played this game many years ago. Alright you nasty guys. Taser beats two by four. There we go. Always the last place you look, right? Can't climb up. Let me through. There we go. That was fun. Then we're into another fight. Oh look. to it than that. Here we go. We got our shotgun, it's doom time.
And there's still one more big fight in this area. Please. I can't take this anymore. My ears. Mm -hmm. My hands. This is when they're going to start pouring through. Oh. We're not done yet. I have three shots. Invasion gone terribly wrong. Hey, jeez. All right, I'll take the submachine gun. One of these guys will eventually drop the fire axe. How do they find me? It's one of the great mysteries of this game. That was your reward for an impressive uh, flipping. There we go. There. Was that really so difficult? I really do like the fact that this is just one location, so it gets enough of a personality.
here. Probably the nails, right? There we go. like serial killer X got to him, painted him up, tortured him, drove him to suicide, just like Anderson did to his victims. Our man must be near. Be careful. Your lab access is terminated as of now. Taxpayers <laughs> would like you using resources when you're officially on suspension. Farrell, listen to me. Talk to Rosa. We're this close to getting the guy. I don't know what poor innocent schmuck you're chasing. <laughs> Can't do it, Farrell. Then play it your way, but we'll find you. Count on it. Looks like you're on your own, Thomas. All right. Carl. Carl. Come on, Mr. Torturer. Oh yeah. <laughs> Don't you want to know what it feels like? We're not even half done. <laughs> you know how this will end. I was put on this earth to bring you to justice. Mm. Your fate is in my hands. Oh, he has. The idea here is we're basically going to have to hunt him down. Unfortunately, I've lost my super taser. The challenge, though, is we have to hunt him down. And it's hard to hear him. There we go. the game checkpoints here and I'm playing this on hard so he does extra damage so the best way is just to uh, get him from the other side like this up or otherwise they're just gonna hit you with that back swing. There we go, got him. Oh. And 
now there's one more level. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoy it, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel, and of course share with your friends, it always helps out. For daily posts on all manner of game design and industry topics, check out game-wisdom.com. To support the site and everything that I do, be sure to check out the Patreon campaign. If we can hit goals, it will mean more content for everyone to enjoy, and I'll be able to support myself and my household. If you want to follow me, you can find me on Twitter at GWBicer for updates throughout the day and random thoughts from me. And lastly, you can find me on Twitch right over there at GWBicer for daily streams most nights around 10 Eastern. Thanks again for watching the video, and be sure to check out more great content coming to the Game Wisdom channel real soon.